Hi, yes, hello, and welcome to another Millennial Movie member request on my birthday! It's my actual birthday today. And so, here's the thing. All I know is last month on my PO unboxing, Stinky LaRue sent me Little Mermaid birthday favors. And, I mean, I have Little Mermaid cups. I got Little Mermaid napkins, tablecloth, balloon, spoons, forks, plates. And so, like, listen, when an upload falls on your birthday, you have to decorate accordingly. So that's just a little bonus. It's my birthday. I had to decorate, you know. Oh, 29, stop it. It's my last year of my 20s. <laughs> if I'm honest with you, didn't think I'd last this long. So we're just out here winging it. Let's get into the preview review. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ashley. And if you're a returner, welcome back. I'm a millennial that likes to go back and watch your older classic movies for the very first time. I give you a preview review, which is what I think the movie's gonna be about based on pop culture. We watch it together, edit it, of course, because copyright. And then I give you my review. Did I like it? Did I not like it? Did it stand the test of time? And I give it stars, all based on personal preference and what the hell do I know? Today, if you haven't seen the title or read the thumbnail, I am watching, it seems to have a couple of different names, Police Story 3 or Super Cop from 1992. Now this request comes from millennial movie member Ingie Bingy, and Ingie Bingy has gotten me to watch Jackie Chan and Lola, like non-American movies. And he brought up this one because I watched Everything Everywhere All at Once, which stars Michelle Yeoh, who also is in this movie. So that's how we got here. I don't know who else is going to be in this uh, other than Michelle Yeoh, who was and the only thing I know from her is Everything Everywhere All at Once. I think I'm just really excited that it's my birthday. And uh, I'm just surrounded by my favorite things. I'm surrounded by Little Mermaid. I'm surrounded by Dolly and Reba. And Reba's even, Reba's even on my earrings. Beans is here too. She, she's laying down on the floor. I'm surrounded by my favorite things. You're here, I'm here. So no more diddle dally. Let's get right on into today's Millennial Movie Member Request, which is a 1992 Super Cop or Police Story 3. Did I see this kind of production house intro in the Jackie Chan movie I've watched recently? Or watched previously? Police Story 3 Super Cop with Jackie Chan. Oh my god, I have come to really love Jackie Chan. Michelle Yeoh, all right. Oh, does this mean I get in credit scenes of Jackie Chan doing all his own stunts? More desperate measures to continue their- Is that Queen Elizabeth Young? Due to accidental punctures in the condoms that had been swallowed. What in the world? Crazy beginning. Yes. Will you please get to the point? He was in something else, the older man in the middle. What we need is a super cop. Well, last time we tried to make a super cop, we ended up with Captain America. Well, that's the brass for you. That guy, I think he was in one of the other Jackie Chan movies, the guy on the left. I think Jackie Chan's just a little cutie. I'll be real honest with you. I just think he is so freaking cute. But doesn't he obey his superiors? Yes, except for the stupid ones. Well, you don't listen to your stupid superiors. Do I was his teacher? This is a very dangerous assignment. Let him do it. I'll say go get James Bond, huh? Good idea. <laughs> I haven't watched James Bond, but like I know he's like a detective cop dude, so I still get the joke. Wow, Jackie Chan is wearing a lot of denim today. <laughs> Sitting in an office all day can be even more dangerous. True. Facts. We're very tricky, huh? But you more than I. You're my superior. <laughs> and if the superior is tricky, then you're more tricky than your subordinate. I'm glad that it's not another dangerous assignment. You can take it easy. No, for sure. I don't know if I'll recognize Michelle Yeoh younger. Like, I don't know how young she'll be in this movie. Uh, what are you doing? I also love how Jackie Chan movies are equally as cheesy as they are action-packed. It's my favorite thing. You're going to be late. They won't fire me for being late. You know what they say, better late than pregnant. If it does crash, I'll hitchhike back. See? <laughs> He's got a plan. Memorize it and then tear it up. Oh, I'm excited about who's on the other end of that phone number then. Goodbye. He memorized it that fast? He gave him my phone number. <laughs> okay. Please. Why does the carpet match their suits? Oh, can he not do that? Guess not. Known as Super Cop Chan of the Royal Hong Kong Police. Well, if that's my title, that's my title. These super cops aren't rare in Hong Kong. They almost grow on trees. Well, what, what makes a person a super cop? Ooh, 
Jack and Jill was looking her up and down. So the chief of security is an attractive lady. She is very pretty. Now, as of this minute, you are Lynn Fouché. Is that Michelle Yeoh? Is that her? Remember that? I got it. Will you kindly repeat it for me? I don't think he remembers it. You're a super cop, huh? And you have no memory. She ain't got no time for you. I'm Kevin Chan, and I was born on April 7th. Me and Jackie Chan, Sarah's birthday. Photographs? How about you and me in the Forbidden City? Oh, you got to focus, baby. Wonderful, beautiful, perfect. Martial arts champion, not a dancer. I was going to say, that does not look martial arty to me. Me, me. See, I feel like Jackie Chan has it all. He could be a little goofball. Ah! He could be a little goofball, but he could also like do all his own stunts. And I love that for him. He's funny and incredibly talented. I love Jackie Chan. The Republic, but I'm in command. Okay, girl. A wrestling champion. What are those spinning? Yeah, what are they doing in the background? I want to do that. I want to do that. I don't. I don't want to do that though. I avoided it. It's not for me. I'm too delicate. <laughs> Super cop. I love how there's that group of people who's in shirts and ties. Like you got all these other people in their workout military gear and you got button up and ties. I love that they clap in unison and not everybody just clapping like this. Okay, this is gonna go well. Why you gotta prep like that is my question. <laughs> You're not acting very super copy right now. I take it back. That right there, that's super copy. What'd he do? Steal his nose? It's a, oh, got your nose. Feet over here, I'll push you. Oh, I want to do this so bad. Not that quickly, though. How do you stop it, huh? I think he figured out how to stop it because he ain't in it anymore. Hello. Poor guy. Do I look like I'm having fun? Oh, oh. I was gonna say, what part of this looks fun to you, ma'am? Do you remember the direction of the coal mine? You know, I have a wonderful memory. Really? Because you haven't really proved that. Some of the guards have no bullets. All right. Well, that doesn't sound safe. Is that coal? Cut that out! <laughs> I'm real confused about what's going on right now. Oh, we're sneaking him out. Oh, we're sneaking him out. That was a good plan. Switch off the engine, huh? Just a routine checkup. No longer a good plan. What's up there? Uh, nothing much. Just a load of coal. Oh my god, I hope that guy buried himself deep enough in there. <laughs> oh, come on, start it. Get going. Oh my god. That was stressful. Oh, you better ski daddle. Don't wait for him anymore. He got got. You better go. Honestly, if we get to ride one of those little train carts down that big old hill we just saw, that's going to be real fun. Glad to see those fighting skills finally showed up. Oh, oh, it's fast. You better go. And uphill? I, I, would, I do not have the cardio for that. I would not make it. The cardio. The quad strength. Well, now we're going backwards. Y'all really had to check the car? Oh, they didn't check the car. They got in it to get up there faster. That is so funny and clever and smart. It's a beautiful view, but you kind of SOL. <gasps> this is about to be so much fun. Oh, wow. What a fun little zipline adventure. Uh, I don't have the grip strength to last that long. On the other side of the mountain is a road. Y'all got to climb another mountain? Good luck. Oh, he's got to climb a mountain, not Jackie. Just give me 500 more. Here, I haven't got any money. I was going to say, what makes you think this man has money? He's, you just broke him out of a labor camp. I want $50,000. Mm, no problem. No problem? Okay, Mr. Hotshot. Piggies! What are y'all doing in a little barn? Pigs eat vegetables. Here, they only feed them fish. That's why they stink. For sure. For sure. Good cover. Whoa! Very rough. Come and tell us. Good food, good wine. You big lion, my guy. Fish cake? Huh? I don't know anything. Did he just call that other man fish cake? I'm sorry. It wasn't my fault. Then why are you apologizing if it's not your fault? 
What is that that he landed in? This is Fusheng, our new brother. Hi. Hi. So did we all learn? If you f around, you find out. Isn't Fusheng your hometown? Yeah. We'll hide out there. Awkward. Oh, we're close. Are you sure? Isn't this Fusheng? Do you need a map? Maybe you should call the commandy lady. Maybe you should call the commander and be like, I don't know what to do now. You mean you don't know where you live anymore? You gotta keep up the lie. I don't know what the plan's gonna be. I don't know what the plan's gonna be. Your mama misses you. Come home quickly. We got a whole fake kid and everything that's in on this? <laughs> come on, come on. This way. Who are these strangers that are in on this lie? <laughs> a whole ass village is in on this lie? Come on, you must be so happy to be home again. I think he's confused to be home. Is she your wife? Brother, you're back. Ah. 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 She's my sister. I see now. <laughs> you have such beautiful eyes. <laughs> For our guests. Go on. Hurry. so stressed about everything all these people are making up this lie and it's just a lot of moving parts and if one person slips up then all of it's over uncle bill have you brought me a watch that's his uncle where are you going it's almost dinner time y'all better not be running away <laughs> this movie is wild <laughs> Even animals that are close to extinction. Like what? Oh no, it's too skinny. A puppy? Panther's here. That's messed oh. up. I'm not over it yet. You two, sit over there. How you gonna invite them to dinner and then be like, go sit somewhere else? The one who ran away from the labor camp. Mind your business. You two stay here. I'll get some more men. Does Panther not realize this is happening? Roast cat with string beans. What did you order? You cannot. I'll make that too. What? So many things are happening. And now there's a gun and people are freaking out. All right, great. We got tasers, broken bottles, guns. Did he just get tased in a booty hole? I guess she can't do anything because if she does anything, never mind. Okay, Michelle, get it to it, girl. Which, I mean, she had some pretty badass moves and everything everywhere all at once anyway, so... I scared him away. Yeah, it worked. It worked. Wasn't what she thought it was gonna be, but it worked. <laughs> and I see you've got an accomplice. What does he think his Commander Yang is doing? Like, what? But then again, I guess I guess the captain should have done that to stick with this, the lie of Kevin's identity. That's hard, keeping up with lies and who's keeping up with the lie as well. And blah. They're getting so I thought he was gonna kiss her and I was gonna be like, remember, She's your sister. <laughs> they killed a security man. Huh? Whoa, girl, what? Let's go. I want to go shopping. I need a stun gun. I was going to say, go shopping for what? You really killed that guy? Of course not. See, even Jackie's having a hard time keeping up with the lies. Oh. Oh, oh girl. Knock first. Aren't I your brother? Yeah, I got a brother, but he ain't just going to see me change clothes. <laughs> Women are the real power of society. You know what? They play brother and sister really well. You hit your brother so hard. What if I were your husband? Wait and find out. So that's a maybe. Oh, a little secret hidden cabinet door. That ship looks like an old pirate boat. Like the only thing it's missing is the sails. Oh, there was a getaway boat in there? Don't kill him. You don't want to add that to your charges. Well, that guy is in a Speedo Speedo. I've never seen a man in a Speedo in real life. Do not DM me. Wants to try one, first. They think it's too early what now. are they doing? A needle? Heroin? Just close your eyes. I don't like needles. What, heroin? I don't know what kind of drugs you shoot up other than heroin. Working hard or hardly working? Now oh, the game is over again. <laughs> What game was it? Do I ever find out? Because the theme music didn't sound familiar to me. I said dump them into the sea. What? You suddenly lost your brains. Those two are cops. How does he know? Why'd you give him that gun? There were no bullets in it. Huh? Oh. <laughs> really? I'm stressed and scared. Oh. 
No bullets. Why do you have bodyguards with no bullets? Welcome to the club. <laughs> now thank me, brother. I'm glad it all worked out, but like, what? That girl died of an overdose. So what? It's not serious. The sharks will enjoy it. The scene was really busy. I didn't know who to keep up with. They're drowning a man right there in their own pool, and then they're gonna swim in it again? And there's her dead body, OD, being taken out to the ocean for the sharks to eat. Ah, yes, I know how efficient you are. So they're gonna kill some people. Can we talk about that thick old cell phone, by the way? I thought that was a coffin at first. <laughs> ah, a dear old friend. A dinner with the general. It makes me nervous. Can't confirm it was not a casket. Was not a casket. You see, we took the other half. You'll have to cut us in. It sounds like it's too late for you to be cut in. Who didn't pay for the last batch? I didn't. Well, you gotta pay for stuff if you wanna buy things. Okay, so you don't talk about that man's wife. No violence. A lot of guns in one room. But no violence. He's the informer. No violence. It's too late for that rule. Great heavens. It's even one shot. You're all gonna die with me. Oh my god! Yeah, that wasn't a bulletproof vest. Like. It was an explosive vest. Don't you ever try to rob me of my share. Well, baby, I don't think they robbed you of your share. You didn't pay for your last one. Go on, shoot me. Shoot. Oh my god, he really did. Well, I mean, he said shoot him, so he really did it. Oh, smart move, honestly. I didn't think about the table being see-through underneath. Maybe it wasn't that smart of a move. Okay, well, yeah, Mr. General, you're, all that is ruined. We are milking these explosions for all they're worth. And honestly, you know what? I respect it. Oh, oh, well, he did it. He did it. Where is sister? Where is Michelle Yeoh? She had on an explosive vest. We need to find her. Oh, okay, there she is. She's fine. She's okay. Shoot, if you got the guts. Girl, what if she did? <laughs> nice. Well, I don't think that's what he meant, but okay. I hope they kiss a little bit. I like those two together. Why are you taking it off? It's explosive! My guy, you didn't hear? Oh, he wasn't, oh, he wasn't in at the dinner. Okay, he was in the bushes with what I thought was a casket. He didn't know the dynamite thing. See if there are any bullets. You're bu right no, there on the no. table? On the table, right there on the table beside you? Uh. He said pretend! Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I really hope this movie has the end credit scenes of them doing their own stunts because I'm excited to see that one. You tried to take the law into your own hands. Tried. Succeeded. Panther, meanwhile, shot. Yeah, I know you're a very clever. Standing there being big brave. My negotiators. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so, like, what you got to say now, homie? You're very convincing. I would say so. Does it still hurt? The gunshot wound? How dare you talk to me in that tone? How dare you put a dynamite vest on her? <laughs> it wasn't a dynamite vest? <laughs> I really thought she was gonna die. I've been getting shot with a bulletproof vest on. I bet that does hurt real bad. I don't want to find out, but I bet it does. Tell him I'll give him the code when I see him. Wow, he married a hard ass just like himself. Good for him. <gasps> is that May? Is that May? Also, is May the same girl from the last movie I watched of Jackie Chan that was really getting on my freaking nerves? We'll tell you when it's time. Well, at least I'm glad I'm not the only one asking questions about it, though. Try to rescue the prisoner? It's possible. <gasps> Look at the... her! That green jumpsuit! Are you kidding me? Yes, I love that for her. Stand still. Don't move. Wow, everybody's in speedos here. Okay. I don't like these close calls between Jackie and, and May. Oh, no. What's the matter? Here's the moment. <gasps> May's gonna think he's cheating on her. And I remember why I didn't like May last time now. She's gonna lose her mind and compromise the whole investigation, and it's gonna be a whole mess. This is a good cover. <laughs> She's really trying to figure it out. Sweetheart. She's always getting herself involved when she doesn't need to be. I'll teach you how to drink. 
Shots, 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 everybody! Oh great, now Jackie's alone and May's gonna come over there. Okay, so we're caught by the girlfriend. Kevin Chan! Nope, do not blow this undercover mission! I remember why I hated May now. Hate her. Like, does she not respect his job? May, you're gonna ruin this again. Oh yeah, but not my type though. Oh, not too expensive, I guess. How much? I like him nice and lively. Nice and lively? This is wild. This has gotten so out of hand. Love it. Like, this is police story three. Does May not realize she's dating a super cop? Murder the guy who threw me into the pool. I'm glad that's an appropriate response. You could take it as a compliment. It means you're really pretty. People would pay to be with you. Every guest here thinks that I'm a hooker that I pick up men. Oh. Oh, he's seeing it again. Oh, he's seeing it again. Go to hell, creep. Let May. go of me. She's having your back right now. Go look in the mirror. You think I'd sleep with someone like you? Oh, boom, roasted. May actually had his back. Oh, I forgot. Let's okay, at the beginning of this movie, Jackie Chan was all denim. Now he is all khaki. What's going on? It's hard to explain. Don't talk about this in an elevator. But just now I almost gave it away, so I did something very clever. Talk about it in an elevator pull of people. Okay, oh don't be late. See? Okay. See? That's why you don't talk in an elevator about these kind of things, and now you're gonna get got. It's for you. Okay. She's gonna ruin the whole mission just because she thought she was really doing something. Chinese security. I've got his girlfriend here. <laughs> oh no, oh not a kick to the titty. With regard to the charge, I am satisfied. Do people still wear wigs? Do judges still wear those kind of wigs anywhere? And convict her on the charge. And tough sentence break. sentence her to death. Real tough break. I forgot it was a death sentence. And now he's in all yellow. Very monochromatic in this movie. I don't really know how this helps or fixes anything, but like, I'm here to find out. Oh, sweet lord. You know that hurted. Oh, no. Oh, that's Michelle. Ain't no way it's really a poisonous gas, because that would compromise everything. We'd have too many casualties. Oh, helicopter coming in hot. Found his girlfriend, though. <laughs> Yeet. How many times did he miss that? That's another one I hope is in the, in the credits. The flexibility and mobility that woman's got. Good for her. Oh, girl. Oh, girl. And there is nowhere for you to hide. Oh, he's about to shoot up the roof of that one! <laughs> I'm so glad he was that. Well, just launched her off the front of the car. He didn't mean to. Oh, what kind of gun is that? Keep away! Keep away! So many people are getting involved, cops, civilians, so many people. I don't know how, listen, there is no way these bad guys get away with this. None. <laughs> Once again, I don't have the cardio for this. Oh, well that's great. <laughs> Put your hands up! They're not on! Well, that didn't last long. Bad ass! Jump, jump, big jump! You know what? Are there any documentaries on, on Jackie Chan? Well, I guess now I know why he's in bright yellow so we can see him flying through the sky like that. Listen, if you wanted to kill him, you could just swing him into a building. Or this billboard works. Could you imagine? This would be the worst death. The most awful death. You drop, you get hit by a train. You don't drop, you get hit by a train. Now you know that coal smoke? Oh no! Oh no! I was gonna say the coal smoke is what got you in. Oh! Like hot on your ass. But then them pointy fruits. That hurt. And then you got these guys. I hope his wife is worth all this trouble. But he's upset because he got a bloody lip. Meanwhile, he's killed like 50 people in this movie. Did they just land a helicopter on a train? That's kind of badass. I love her on a dirt bike. This is so much fun. Fun! Fun, fun, fun! Girl, you brought fists to a knife fight. The flexibility needed to do like kung fu, karate, all these fighting styles is amazing. How are the 
propeller's still going after it got taken out by that metal pole. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, girl, you can't bring no sissy fighting like hair pulling into this kind of action. Oh, yeah, because it's going to take out the helicopter. Oh, no! We saw him get squished by a flaming helicopter. Once again, I'm going to ask the question. Is your wife worth it? So they've got the money. And it's over! Oh, man! I thought there was going to be a little bit of romance. And didn't you all tell me that Jackie Chan also sings, too? Like, is this him singing? Like, this man for real swaying from a helicopter ladder. Michelle Yeoh also did that herself? No way. She did? I really assumed it wasn't her. Holy shit. I don't know why I thought Jackie Chan was like the only badass allowed on the set. Oh, 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 oh! What if she gets hit by cars? Oh my god, they both fell down. Michelle and the guy, and the protector guy. I know, I would have laughed at that scene too. <laughs> I would have laughed at that scene too, though. Oh, him got hurted? Like, how long does it take for Jackie Chan to make a movie? Because what if he gets hurt? Okay. <laughs> Let's talk about it. Okay, number one, I can't believe that I forgot that I share a birthday with Jackie Chan. So, happy birthday to Jackie Chan, too. So, this movie just works out on multiple levels for me. Didn't even think about it. I don't know why I thought that Michelle Yeoh wouldn't do her own stunts. But I didn't think she did her own stunts. She rode a motorbike on top of a train. She fell from a location onto a moving vehicle. Granted, she fell off that vehicle at that point. Damn it, I had wished so hard that we would get the scene of Jackie Chan jumping from behind the car into the seat. I wanted to see how many times that took. So this is why everybody looked and sounded familiar. So I have watched Police Story. So that makes sense. Uncle Ben, Uncle Ben, not Spider-Man. Uncle Guy was in this and I knew, I was like, what other movie has he been in a relationship with May with? Oh, let me tell you something. If y'all go watch Police Story, my Police Story reaction, May got on my last nerve. I hated her in Police Story. She was a lot more tolerable in this one, probably because she wasn't in most of it, if I'm honest with you. A young Michelle, I mean, she's beautiful and everything everywhere all at once. Michelle Yeoh is, you know. Her in this movie? Her in that green jumpsuit? Are you kidding me? Legs for days. Beautiful. Love that she's a total badass. I just really, I have really grown to appreciate Jackie Chan. And it's, I'm 98% sure, 99% sure now I think about it. All thanks to Ingi Bingi who has got me to watch a few Jackie Chan, I mean I say a few, like Police Story, maybe one other one and now this one, like three or four movies he's got me to watch with Jackie Chan in it. And like I said at some point in this um, movie that I love that Jackie Chan can be goofy in his movies but also like a total badass and then I remembered that y'all told me that he also sings. Like Jackie Chan is a man of many talents and I love that. The explo- okay first off the explosions in this film. I love a good explosion. I'm an Aries baby. I'm a pyromaniac. I love fire. I love explosions. Love the explosions in this movie. I'm glad I got to see Jackie Chan again. Honestly, if I'm honest with you, I think I enjoyed this police story more than the first one because I hated May so much. May took up so much of the movie, first one, that like, and she was awful and whiny and awful the entire time. In this one, she just wasn't in it often. And I really like that. Love Michelle Yeoh. You want to know something? I give this movie four out of five stars. Not five out of five because I wouldn't watch it again tomorrow. Now I definitely want to watch Police Story 2 just to complete the trilogy. If anything, I'm also really excited to hopefully find out some more Michelle Yeoh movies because until everywhere, everything, all at once, always, until that movie, I had never heard of her. And then when Ingi Bingi saw me watch that, he was like, oh, I want you to watch Super Cop, Police Story 3. Love Michelle Yeoh, love Jackie Chan, my birthday twin. And it just, his comedy, his action, and I love that he includes the bloopers, like the failed stunts. And I also love in the scene where Michelle falls off the car, in the credits, where Michelle falls off the car and then the stunt helper man also falls off the car. Like Jackie's one of the first guys to hop out the car and go check on them. You know, he didn't just wait for the medics to arrive. Like he was checking on the other people too. And I think that's really cool. Jackie Chan seems like a very genuine person. He seems like a very genuine, nice person. You know what I mean? That's what, that's the vibe I get from Jackie Chan. I'm not here to review Jackie Chan himself. I'm here to review this movie. Explosions, badassery, some funnies. I really enjoy it. Just wouldn't watch it again tomorrow. Four out of five stars for Police Story 3, 
super cop. Now I gotta figure out how to get my hands on one of them little, they look like a hay bale holder, like a hay feeder holder. One of them big round things that you hold on to and da, 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 da. gotta figure out how to get my hands on that. Well, anyways, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for being here on my birthday. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, stick around. Coming up Monday, actually this Sunday, this Sunday, April 9th. I know it's Easter, but we are going to have our monthly hangout unboxing. And then Monday is going to be Beverly Hills Cop. Friday is going to be A Night at the Opera. The next Monday is Oh Brother, Where Art Thou? The next Friday is Total Recall. So that's what's coming up for April. And of course, every Tuesday and Thursday, you can join me over on Twitch. We're playing Alien Isolation right now. Thank you so much for being here. Links to social media down below if you want to be my friend outside the YouTube verse. And I'll see you right back here on Monday, hopefully Sunday, for the live. Bye.